So, guess who predicted the next character? So, Final Fantasy Fighters Pass 1, of course, was just proven to be all these characters. And, as well, all these characters here. And Rose of Ben was completely 100% right. So, before Bayleth was revealed, Rose of Ben basically said the meat costume what fighters would be released with Bayleth would be Old Tower, Carpet, and the Rabbit Head, and two Mega Man costumes. So, Rose of Ben has basically again, has been proven correctly. The only thing that he has not been proven is that some form of Minecraft content, potentially a boss, will appear as DLC. As the worst thing, with the six four characters in left, I won't be surprised if Steve as well get into like a me costume or something like that. But, Rosaban was completely, 100% right that Bayworth was going to be a playable character. Of course, you know. So, yes. It's proof that Rose of Ben, at least when it comes to Smash Brothers weeks, because there were some other weeks that he has posted, um, Star Fox, <laughs> Star Fox Grand Prix was still doesn't exist to this day, and, you know, he predicted almost everything of Smash Brothers except for one thing. He, you know, he predicted that all these characters would be deconfirmed, all these characters would not be the next fighter at the very least, and the only thing he has been disproven on, that the first fighter from Fighters Pass 1 will be a Skull Enix character. But even then, the Skull Enix character was put into Smash Brothers as a DLC as Hero. So the only thing he got wrong was the first character of Fighters Pass being a Skull Enix character. And basically, the Skull Enix character was Hero, say that Edgework was going to be another character, would be a part of Fighters Pass 1. He said it will be the first one, but it wasn't proven true, it was proven to be Zoka and from Persona 5, not from the movie. Okay. You know. So, Rose Ben was right. He was right about Bayworth being in Super Smash Bros. So, that means Rose Ben has another badge of honor underneath the Rika community, proving that he is very legitimate when it comes to Smash Bros. Weeks, and that all these characters that were leaked for Smash Bros. are all been deconfirmed. All these characters were deconfirmed. So, he was correct that a lot of these characters that he deconfirmed were true. And, and before he confirmed that Bayworth, he said that Bayworth was going to be the next character, which is in the game now. So, yes, Rose Ben leaked the character as well. So, that's basically it. So, what do you think about Rose Ben again? You know, he does have some iffy credibility when it comes to his older weeks. Of, you know, Star Fox Grand Prix, remember that? And it's still not a Nintendo Switch game, okay? But that's basically it, so, Rose Ben has been proven correct again. Rose Ben, of course, he is the master. He is one of the masters of Smash Brothers Weekers. You know, there's a few others, King Zell and Savi. They're the masters of Smash Brothers Weeks and Weeks in general. So, of course, a round of applause for Rose Ben for weaking the next character again. And I was actually surprised that you know Bayworth was revealed, but now we know Bayworth, most like Piranha Plant and every other Smash Brothers character, was leaked a few days before release. Which does ruin the surprise, but if you really don't want to pay, if you really don't want to have the surprise ruined for the next character, just don't pay attention to any leaks, and it'll be that simple. That's basically it. Goodbye.